Namaskar. My name is Rishi. I am a volunteer from Rikshify, an organization that is dedicated to reverse the effects of climate change. And in this video, we are going to talk about the Marco Temporal Bill. Thousands of indigenous people have marched on the Brazilian capital against the bill proposed by the federal government. Deforestation in Brazil has increased by nearly 50 percent, reaching a 12-year high. Bows and arrows on one side, riot gear on the other. Amazonia. Minha casa. É a minha casa. Minha casa. Amazonia é minha casa. Amazonia é nossa casa. Amazonia. É nossa casa. Okay, but what is it and why should I care for it? See, you have a family to care, a house to live in this society and a work to do for generating money to survive in this world. Everything seems good, right? But now, just imagine, your house is destroyed, you have been fired from your work, now you and your family doesn't have a place to live or any money to survive in this world. Now, what you will do? Probably, you'll first reach out to your neighbors or relatives nearby for the help. But you saw that the same thing has happened with them. Now what? So you all together decide that we'll approach the government for the help. And you all went to the government. And there you find that it is the government only that is responsible for all that has happened with you. So what you gonna do now? How will you feel? I just want you to stop this video for one minute and think how helpless you are in this situation because this is what the Marco Temporal Bill can do to the indigenous people. According to this bill, the indigenous people who occupied their land in Amazon forest before the Brazilian constitution was made in 1988 will lose their lands. And not only this, the constructions of highway and hydroelectricity plants will also be started in the lands of indigenous people, that is our Amazon forest. Indigenous people protect forest and culture. It's a no lie that Amazon is the lungs to this world. And in the times of climate change where we are seeing its worst effects on us, it is the most critical thing to be saved. Indigenous people has been here from thousands of years and are the core reason that our Amazon forest has not converted into desert yet. In Brazil, the government has two houses, the lower house and the upper house, which collectively take decision. The Marco Temporal Bill has been already agreed and passed by the lower house and now everything is in the hands of this man. He is the president of the upper house. Well, if you see, passing the bill is not in the hands of this man. It's in our hands. But how? See, the group of indigenous leaders from across the Amazon basin are aligned to stop the Marco Temporal Bill and they are appealing us to sign this petition whose link is in the description. And as I said, the power is in our hands. Let's use social media to aware other people about this by sharing this video or any other post or video using these hashtags. Saying, we might not be able to physically help the indigenous people, but at least let's do what we can from our end. Remember, raising your voice can be a reason to save us all. Because if this bill passes, then we won't have much time to live here in this planet. And before ending this video, let me tell you, the same situation happened in Hasde Forest, which is Amazon to India, where the government and industrialists snatched the land rights of tribal people for mining the coal, making them homeless and workless. More on it later. But for now, let's do what we can for our indigenous people. Remember, do share this video because the bill doesn't await you.